。對於省府指示數理繼續過渡市警計劃，市長 Brandon Lock 就發出聲明表示失望。批評省府嘅決定係基於唔準確嘅假設，咁將會令到居民以及商業承受巨額嘅財政負擔。蘇學南報導。對於蘇利市政府喺省府公佈之後發出聲明，關注市民同埋商業會承受巨大財務壓力。碧斯公共安全及法務廳長法務副指出，蘇利市向省府要求一億五千萬用於警隊過渡，市議會決策舉棋不定，代價更大。Um, and that is based on Surrey's numbers, on their own numbers in terms of what the costs are. The other thing that's important to remember to, as well is that if Surrey were to go back to the RCMP, they would be responsible for 100% of those costs going back. So they've already spent, I think, well over $100 million um, in, on the transition to date. 佢提醒民眾，省府同騎警嘅合約期滿，勞資雙方正喺度談判薪酬調整。即使保留騎警，亦都預期會有額外開支。The RCMP are currently in contract negotiations, and they are moving to get to parity with、uh, Vancouver Police Department, the Ontario policing situation, because RCMP have been, you know, significantly lower paid than other police forces. That has changed. 范华富重申，省府已经拨出二亿七千万，喺未来三年招聘二百六十二名卑斯皇家骑警，而皇家骑警警力长期人手不足。市府若果坚持保留骑警，只会摊薄其他地方政府警力，造成公共安全问题。Those vacancies deal with things such as major crime,、uh, rural, small town policing in many parts of the province,、uh, many specialized units, and it's important that those positions are filled. And it's important that recruits coming out of the depot are also able to go to those communities which are facing considerable、uh, stresses, not just Surrey. 苏里市长 Brandon Lock 今日就回应话，不满省府系基于偏颇嘅假设作出决定，无法证明能够聘请足够市警，而且比骑警更能提供安全社区，反而市民同商业可能要承受过度嘅巨额开支。新时代电视苏汉南报道。